you make uh, you make uh, two laps. Yeah, that is the feeling. But I didn't push because it was a uh, new break. Okay, new break. Yeah, new break. So I hope uh, I hope it's fine. But there is a lot of pickup on track. Okay. So just for you to know, especially if turn 14, yes. turn 14, there is a lot of pickup. So there no. you have to try to be very, very, very inside. Yes, at the gravel. At the gravel. Yeah. Yes, okay. Because if you're a little bit, then you straight away you're in the pickup. Perfect. Yeah. Okay. okay. That's the main thing. I the rest, you know. Very close. Okay. So I go, Maida. Do the radio check when you're ready. Race two at Misano in the sunshine in high temperatures is go. Green light goes on and a great start by Van Thor. Martin switches sides to go to the outside of Niederhauser. Van Thor weaves around to try and defend on the run to turn one. Niederhauser back up the inside of Martin. Retakes second place then. Second place, look, Niederhauser and Martin go absolutely touch to toe out of turn 12. BMW on the outside line, Audi on the in. Niederhauser goes through, Martin will look for the switch back. There's no gap going up to the hairpin though, because exactly where Maxi Martin needs to be, there is an Audi parked on his line. Valentino Rossi, the best of the stoppers. There he is, hard at work. Must get sweat out of his eyes. He's on lap number 21. And Valentino Rossi carrying on the good work in that first stint by Maxi Martin. And he's getting away because in the first sector, he's pulled another half a second over Leisure. And the Valentino Rossi fan club are starting to celebrate. We've got just under two minutes of the race to go. There he is. The lead gap is still around the five second mark. He has stretched it since the beginning of the stint. And here at his home circuit where he had three MotoGP successes, he's about to start the last lap. And so Valentino Rossi accelerates then now out to turn 16. There's lots of applause for that. He's on his last lap and a first outright win in a GT car beckoned.
You know, alone is eh, very good. It's very easy. You feel uh, more cold, uh, you know, <laughs> more relaxed. But when I restart, I think, fuck, it's not true. It's impossible. So for sure, somebody has to stop yeah. and arrive, even, maybe not in front, but there, because I was alone. Yeah. I exit from the turn 10 and I look there. One, <laughs> two, three, four. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and after, anyway, I have a very good pace. Yeah. Yeah. Very good. Uh, the car was very good. And what did you do in the lap? You stopped on track? I stopped on track, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I stopped on track to say it's out to the car. <laughs> when uh, you have the, the other bike and uh, at the beginning try to understand because it's quite slippery so is uh, we will start uh, slow and uh, and after you can uh, you can try change is uh, straighter it's not the first time on a bike right no but i'm not used to ride bike i have a scooter it's the same it's the same electric yeah, it's the same, yeah. Same. Same, same, same. Guys, the pro rider. Pro rider. For first. Pro rider for first. Now we prepare the track. I put the suit also and I go to the yeah. track. <laughs> A new experience, yeah. So uh, I, I try to help him on the race track, but he has to help me now. Huh? <laughs> We have to understand how lucky we are to be here because I think like thousands of people will want us to be here. I hope we won't die at least, <laughs> but to enjoy it, to enjoy it. But if you break something, you can say, yeah, now I broke my leg or I break my arm at Valley's Ranch. That's something interesting to say. We can stand up. We are our heroes up on our shoulders. Great, but it's really hard. Huh? It's I was not expecting to be so slippery. Yeah, uh, it's slippery, yes. Like, high speed corner is quite okay, but slow speed is uh, worse. It's slippery, yeah. But it's good, huh? Now, in one hour, coming better. Yeah, because, already, uh, with at the end, I was more forward, yes. and it was much better. Yeah, you have to stay very, yeah, very forward. Yeah. What's the technique? Uh, you let, break mainly with the front as well? You break also a little bit with the front. The, the, the technique am? is try to Break a little bit with the rear yeah. and put the bike a little bit uh, in oversteer yeah. because if you are straight, straight and you break and you entry, the rear uh, don't have break. Yeah, sorry, the front. Yeah. The front. If 
the bike is a bit more uh, on the slide, it's okay. So it needs to be on the slide, mandatory. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. no. Allora, we, we start, we start, we make a lap piano piano. And we see. Now we can see. We're not fast, but at least we have some fun. Start, but uh, you don't go on the left, you go straight. Four laps, okay? That's it hard, can you move it? Let's put on ice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I try one lap? With the noise? Ah, with, if you can move it, you can race. <laughs> it's like proper pushing, proper racing, crashing. We do the same now. I'm stressed. I will push maximum uh, to reach uh, the finish line. <laughs> Stressful moment. <laughs> I need every of those guys uh, next week. So, uh, but uh, what an incredible moment for everyone. I mean, it's just uh, awesome what we what we experience here. I mean, it's great. <laughs> At least I finished the race. Still P2, but it's okay. Eh? It was part of the race. At the beginning of the day, I told you, if I have to die today, I will die today. And I said to, I said to Vale, I, I heard a crack in my, my knee and my ankle. He said, yeah, but can you move it? I moved it and he said, mm, it's fine. Wow. Then I jumped back on the, on the bike and, and I finished the race. <laughs>